perfect the Piaf, this young stallion has had less than eight months of training on it, and we think he's doing an outstanding job. Majestic Passage. Bella, handled by Olga Hartsock and Jennifer Bowie. The Mazair. This valuable rear back on those hind legs, this time holding that pose for several seconds at an angle of about 30 degrees. In battle, it was used to help a rider in saddle be taken out of reach of an enemy foot soldier's sword or spear but it's also considered to be the ultimate in the collection of the stallion's hindquarters. Holding all of his weight on those hind legs for even a few seconds requires a great deal of strength, stamina, and balance. It's performed by Conversano Tropina, handled by riders Petrayana Chokova and William Lopez. Creole is a majestic leap into the air, front legs tucked under, at the very peak of that leap, a powerful snap kick out with the back legs. In battle, it was used to help a rider, surrounded by enemy foot soldiers, to make a quick escape. It's performed by Neapolitano Venera, handled by our head rider, Reda Garza. First, let's take a moment and talk about this young stallion. Neapolitano Banera joined us on tour four years ago, and he was only five years old, making him a true exception to the rule of six to nine years of schooling before performing in our show, also making him the youngest stallion we've ever had on tour with us in our 37-year history. We gave him a nickname four years ago, and if he lives to be 100, he will never outgrow it. To us, he'll always be the baby. Like many babies, he does tend to be just a little bit spoiled. For one thing, until recently, this was all he did in our show, giving him way too much free time to get into trouble. Now that we're using him in some of the other drills, he prefers to relax backstage before a performance, usually in a hot tub with two fillies and a bottle of champagne. <laughs> Elizabeth Sorensen. 